hello welcome to the latex learning series in the last video i have introduced you about lists and uh, symbols now in this video i am going to show you the typesetting text which includes fonts effects and font sizes so when you are writing your document you have to type in different font effects for different formats as well as you need different font sizes so there are some font effects the first one is the words in italic so you have command for it that is slash text it and within curly brackets you will get the words in italic format or effect so the other one is if you want to type the words slanted then slash text sl for slanted so you will get the slanted effect in your if in your document words slanted and the other one is uh, words in small caps that is slash text small caps is sc words in small caps it is separate small caps so you can remember the sc command for it next is text if you want uh, words in bold then text bf is its command words in bold and for words in teletype should be written as text 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 and tt tally type which will become triple t so words in tally type sans series words will be written as slash text sf sans series this is very simple and easy sans serif words and uh, the roman words can be written as slash text r m roman roman r m for roman so and the last one is underline words slash underline and within curly brackets your text will be underlined underline words now let's compile and check it how our effects effects let's see um now you can see words in italic first one is these words are in italic format and the uh, slanted words you can see different font effects and words in small caps you can see the difference here and words in bold are the bold words and words in italic type are different these are different and underline words are in underline format and font sizes next is font sizes now close this and next come towards the font sizes in the font sizes we have ti we have uh, tiny tiny words and uh, we can go from tiny tiny words to huge words so first one is tiny tiny that is slash within curly brackets you have to write tiny 
and you will get tiny tiny words and the next one is script sized words that is slash script size and you can also write curly brackets script size words okay you can add footnote size words at slash footnote and within curly brackets you will type any text say for example footnote size text and you will get a the text in curly brackets in footnote size text and next is small words that is slash small and within curly brackets you will get its effect small size words and uh, next is normal size words that is slash normal normal size words and the next is large words that is slash large and then with within curly brackets large words one here i i have write the one because it is the large one large words which is this in small caps large and uh, another is uh, large that will be in capital l the large of capital large will give some word large of previous large that is capital l and other words are in small this will give the effect of large word but uh, large words but it will be somewhat larger than previous large words so we can have large large words another and this is the second large large command and the third is capital large that will be in caps lock writing this large and we will get the more larger words in this effect large large words and the final is huge words that will be slash huge uh, it's without caps lock on slash huge 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 words so let's compile it visible i i can make it visible for you by adding it uh, to next line we can uh, we can send over text to next line by double slash command double slash now you will be able to see separate separate commands of font effects and you will see uh, everything on the separate line only double slash command so now so now and let's now compile it you can see on separate lines for more bigger preview for you you can see the difference font effects words in italic 
and these are the font effects and uh, you can see the font sizes from tiny tiny words to huge words these are tiny tiny words so that's it in the next video i'm going to show you how to insert equations so stay connected thank you